Well, the return of the 2020-2021 basketball season in Guinea last December has been a welcome development after the competition was halted for nine months due to the global pandemic. CGTN's Wanja Mungai reports. The launch of the new season took place in one of Conakry's 28th September 2009 mini stadiums. With several matches on the program, the championship kicked off with the women's and men's league to action with League One teams tipping off a few days later. On the opening day, the women's Red Star beat Federal League Center 59-32, while the men's team of the latter was defeated by the Do Angels Club 50-45. The Guinean basketball players welcomed the competition. I am happy to be back on the court. I kept fit during the COVID-19 lockdown because I was training a lot at home with my brother and also my coach. My goal this season is to redouble my efforts and succeed in basketball like the big stars of the NBA. This year, we are aiming for the title of Champion of Guinea. Above all, we want to be selected for the national team. I think that this is possible by participating in training sessions and by following the instructions of our coaches. The COVID-19 pandemic has had an impact on us because we stayed at home for nine months without playing. This lowered our performance level, reason why we are very happy that the championship is back on track. We are very happy tonight to have this victory. We are also happy to finally be back on the court. We are determined to double our efforts because we want to go far in this championship. Our wish is to play in League One next year. Guinean basketball is doing well because we are now playing the African Cup after an absence of 32 years. We are on all the boards, girls and boys. We were recently ranked fourth in Cairo and fourth in prayer. So in the years to come, we can expect top Guinean teams and why not win trophies? In order to reduce the risk of spreading the coronavirus, basketball matches this season in Guinea Conakry are being played exclusively outdoors. This year, the country expects to win at least one trophy in future international competitions. Wanja Mungai, CGTN.